Welcome to Candid Africa, truthful and unapologetic. Today's Candid Africa clip comes from the Netflix series Black Earth Rising. It's about the prosecution of African war criminals and follows the life of a Rwandese genocide survivor. Please listen to what the African student has to ask the ICC prosecutor. One of the world's leading prosecutors in international criminal law. And I get to ask you a question. Which is? Uh, yes, it's this. What motivates you to vomit up all this neo-colonialist bullshit? You don't have to answer that. Mm, it's all right. I'm motivated to see justice done, wherever the crime took place. Oh, and it just so happens all these crimes, they take place in Africa. We only prosecute those cases a country is unable or unwilling to prosecute for itself. Well, what about the West Bank? I believe that's an active situation. S -s situation? But when it comes to action, there are at least 40 individuals being prosecuted by the International Criminal Court right now. And each and every one of them are Africans. Black Africans. And I'm sure they all have a case to answer, properly represented in a court of law. But you were telling us you successfully prosecuted one of those cases. Yes. And that doesn't make you feel embarrassed? Embarrassed? Not at all. Really? Why not? After all, isn't what you do just the latest example of self-righteous Western paternalism? Of exactly the same sort that for hundreds of years has systematically decimated that continent of its wealth, its governments, its religions, and most of all, its people. And now, having done it, you have the temerity to expect them to turn to you for justice. For justice that only you can provide for a crime that surely would never have happened had your world not gone there in the first place. So you're right, I wouldn't feel embarrassed. As if I was you, I'd feel ashamed. Stop. What did you think of the points the African students made? Have you watched the Netflix series yet? What do you think of the ICC? Let us know in the comments below. Did you like or hate what you heard? Let us know in the comments below.